Hello YouTubers, Kirby's and other vacuums here and I'm going to show you today how to repair a Dyson DC-17 animal. I've actually found this in the trash. It's kind of a shame really because it actually still works perfectly fine. It just needs a new belt. Now I don't have a new belt, but I'm going to show you guys how to do it. It's really straightforward and simple, really. Just take these, and a coin works better. But I don't have a coin. There. That'll help be able to see. There. Take these and twist them to the unlock position. If I switch my hands. And then this cover just pops right off. And see, you've already got your belt exposed. Here's the brush roll. And here's the belt. And the part number you want is going to be 11710-01-02. And the way it comes out is you can just grab an end and pull it until it comes out now it's just hanging by the belt at this point you just kind of spin it around one direction until you can get the belt to one end and then you just twist it out brush rolls free and then with the belt you just kind of pinch it a little bit and it comes right out now what my belt's problem is is that these teeth are almost completely sheared off I mean they kinda look like they're still there but looks are deceiving these things are almost completely shot that and this belt is stretched one thing you'll want to check for too <clears throat> if you're Kirby's <laughs> I said Kirby that's funny if your Dyson's belt roll is not spinning when it lands on the ground it's to make sure that you don't have hair on this shaft um, a lot of folks will have hair completely wrapped around that shaft and you want to make sure that that's not your case anyway um, if you don't have hair and it's still not spinning you're going to want to replace your belt with this little guy right here. This is your Dyson belt. And I'm sorry, I gave you guys the wrong thing. Um, you'll actually want this number to order your belt with. 0814DS. I'm sorry. <clears throat> anyway. To install, the reverse is what you do. Pinch it, and stick it in there, and just kind of fish it around a little bit until you get it on the shaft. Leave it hanging, and then grab your belt roll, and fish your belt roll into. fish it in and then just reverse it. spin it one direction until you can get it onto the teeth make sure you have it fully lined up and then <clears throat> when you're putting this all back in you have a rounded edge and a flat edge Make sure your rounded edge is going into the machine on both ends at the same time. It's really only being held in by the tension of the belt. Kind of hard to do this with one hand. There we go. Let's see. It wants to spin because the teeth are very 
non-existent. <laughs> and that's really it. Uh, once you have your new belt installed, which I don't have mine yet, I just reinstalled the old one. Line your stuff up. Pop it in place. And then twist these. It would seriously help if I had a coin. Well, you get the picture. And anyway, that's how you would replace your belt and fix a brush roll that's not spinning on a Dyson DC-17. Hopefully I've helped you guys out. Have a good night.